Dr. Jeff Brown here from InsightsUniversity.com. Today's short five minute lesson is this. You want to get into the habit of being more processed focused in your thinking and less in result focus. So again, you want to get into the habit of being more process focused in your thinking and less in result focus. Everybody wants the end result but very few people want or even understand the process that produces the end result that they seek for themselves. You got to get this. For every end result, it is undoubtedly connected to some process. And it is the working of that process that will produce the end result. So if you're primarily focused on just the end result and you don't understand and you don't work your process, the chances of that end result manifesting into your life goes down dramatically. Now let's take it a step further. Within any process, there will be required actions. So within any process, there will be required actions. So, after you see the end result that you want for yourself, after you form that vision, and that's important, you want to be very clear on your vision because the universe cannot hit a moving target. But after you form the vision, after you see the end result that you want for yourself, the next question you should ask, well, what is the process that's connected to my end result? And within that process, what are the required actions that I must do, that I must work so that I can trigger, so that I can trigger that end result coming into my life, that end result manifesting into my life. For example, let's say if the end result that you want for yourself is sustainable weight loss. The next question you should ask, so what is the process of sustainable weight loss? And within that process, what are the required actions that will produce sustainable weight loss? The answer to that question would be number one required action, eating real food. Next required action, maybe getting seven to eight hours of sleep a night, drinking adequate amounts of water and managing your stress. So the point being, form your vision, see your end result, but then please ask the question, what's the process? that will produce that end result for myself. And within that process, what are those required steps? What are those required actions? And then be willing to work those actions. Be willing to do those actions because that is the most likely way you will begin to trigger that thing that you want to come into your life. So that's today's short lesson. Be more process focused in your thinking and less end result focused because guess what's going to happen when you do that? The end result will take care of itself. So if you like this video, please click like, share it, or subscribe. So until the next short five minute lesson, take care and we'll see you soon. Bye bye.